Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So excuse the way I look, there's been a lot of moving parts. We've been doing a lot today. Finally been able to rest a little bit because we've been packing. Our house is a complete packing disaster. We have moving boxes, we have things that are on, our, on their way to Goodwill. A lot of things have been happening, but I wanted to make this video to give you guys an update on what we were planning to do next. But before we get started, this video is sponsored by Mobs, so huge shout out to them, and I'm going to insert a quick clip, and again, thank you for them, and stay tuned to continue the video. Get ready with me to go to bed. Thank you, Mobs, for gifting me this beautiful satin pillowcase in the color Midnight Onyx. I was extra excited to receive this pillowcase because it protects your hair, meaning your lashes, your eyebrows, everything. They also sent over this beautiful scrunchie that matches the pillowcase perfectly and this is a perfect alternative for your traditional elastic hair ties and this was a perfect duo for a good night's sleep. Alright, my hair is a mess. I'm not, trying. I'm not trying to look pretty in today's video at all guys so please just bear with me and try to look past the hair, try to look past everything because I just got out of the shower and my hair when it dries like this, it dries crazy, okay? For those that don't know me and for those that are new to my channel, my husband and I are both real estate investors and we invest in short term rentals, we invest in like Airbnb, furnished finders, you name it, midterm rentals, that's what we're into right now. Okay, so the last video I made was that we were finally going to be moving back to the west coast because I miss my mom, I'm very family oriented, but unfortunately it looks like we're going to have to be here a little longer, we're going to have to stay here in Indiana purchase another property, be here for another year, and make the best of it. Uh, and the reason why is because, the reason why is because I don't feel like we have a reliable team to delegate all our work. The last time we did a turnover for our pro one of our properties, our cleaning lady left us very disappointed. She did not it looked like she didn't sweep and it looked like she didn't mop so i had to go in there and do the work and i'm like why am i paying you and it just made me really think and get scared like if i go thousands of miles away i have these properties that are under my name you know it's gonna be representing me and my husband and we're relying on people to make it look good and, you know we're paying them and everything but they they don't treat it like that so i'm going to search for somebody in the indianapolis area that actually takes pride in their work because right now unfortunately what we have is not gonna work also our handyman he's not reliable he's counseled on us before making us look bad in front of our guests and uh, furnished finders they're staying here a little, a little longer so it's very important to have a reliable handyman a reliable cleaning lady or men and right now we don't have both we don't have either so it's very stressful to say the least and we're gonna have to stay here to manage it we're thinking about buying a property that's down the street so we can con we're not control but we can manage it kind of from afar and start kind of like separating ourselves separating ourselves from being so hands-on but still be down the street just in case we can come in and and still be there for our business you know what i'm saying so it just really breaks my heart because i was ready mentally and emotionally to leave and go and move on and finally move to a place that i can call home and be close to my family again because again like i'm thinking about my son being in sports and my my mom coming and seeing him because i i pray to god that my kids are as close to me as i am to my mom because the love i have for her and my sister I, is just like, we're friends, we're, she's my everything, like we're best friends. She's like, that's true like love. Like there's no fake, there's nothing fake about her. And I can't say the same thing about like over here, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, there's a lot of ranting, but when, it's been a lot, okay? And that's why when, <clears throat> excuse me, when I see a lot of like people on social media, like YouTube or like Instagram that are real estate investors as well, and they just talk about all the good things, right? Like ugh, typical, they talk about all the great things, how wonderful these businesses and everything. But a lot of people don't talk about the sacrifices that have to, you have to go through to get to that point. And for us, for example, we're doing like the home hacking. So we have to be, we have to be here a year. And unfortunately, when things 
don't go as planned or as smoothly, then we're gonna have to be here another year. So our homework from now to the next year is that we 100% get a good team, a second good team and a third good team, just in case the first one doesn't come through, the second one comes through, and just in case both of them don't come through, we got a, we got a backup, a th third backup. Because I want to be, I don't want to be so hands-on, okay, in, in this business. I would, what am I managing? Gas coming in and out, but when it comes to cleaning, I don't want to do the cleaning. Uh, when it comes to maintenance and fixing things, I don't want to be fixing things. That's not why I got into the business. I'm willing to pay somebody to do all that, but I'm not, a, I'm not a person that has all the luxury all the time and I'm not in the business of cleaning and I'm not in the business of fixing things. I'm in the business of owning properties and renting them out. So it's, it's a lot. And when I see all these people on Instagram and, and YouTube talking about like all the great things, I want to see their start. I want to see their stories when they first started. Okay, I want to see that because it's gonna help a lot of people understand that not all of not everyone has it that easy. But rant over. The update is we might have to be here another year. I'm gonna give a final decision within the next week. If nothing changes, we will be gone. I mean, we'll stay here in Indianapolis for another year. But thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for all the love and support you guys always so show. And I hope that um, our story kind of helps somebody out there. Don't get fooled by all the social medias, okay? Some people are out there for the views and that's all they care about. And they're willing to portray something that's not true. So just have a, have a good eye for that. But I hope you guys have a blessed day. We love you. Bye. Have a great day.